The NFL draft begins next Thursday and this year because of the coronavirus. Many prospects have been unable to personally showcase their talents in front of NFL teams. But former Old Dominion University standout Zach Paschal, an NFL receiver who uses his hands to control passes, he says this year's prospects need to use theirs to control what they can control. You can't make a team want to look at you. You can only control what you can control, and that's your work ethic, you know, what you do on the field, what you do off the field. And once Pascal got on the field, it's been nearly impossible to keep him off it. After going undrafted in 2017, despite leaving ODU as the program's all-time leading receiver, Zach was cut four times in a nine-month span. The hardest thing was like getting released and then still trying to have a positive mindset, just saying, okay, this is just a stop in my story. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. I'm going to keep going. After signing with the Indianapolis Colts in 2018, Pascal has played in every game the last two seasons, leading the squad in receiving yards, touchdowns, and targets last year. In December, the Colts signed him to a new two-year contract. It feels good right now. You know, I'm able to help my family out. That's, that's the biggest thing. I'm, I'm still locked in, regardless of how much success you have on the field. When you come off that field, you still got to, you know, grind for the next time you step back on the field because every player is not promised to you. Um, but I'm, I'm locked in regardless of the success I had or the, the bad seasons I had. It, right now, I'm locked in. Zach is locked in. And he's also proof the NFL draft is not the key to a player's success story in the league. For the Chevrolet Sports Report, I'm Adam Winkler.